Hi, I'm Doug here at Global West. Today I thought I'd talk to you about some Delalum bushings for Camaros from 1982 through 92. Now you may not know what a Delalum bushing is. Delalum bushings is something we created back in the 80s, and it's a six bearing surface design. And the reason why we do the six, and I'll explain it to you, is this is a housing that presses into your control arm. It's a direct replacement. We have an insert that slides inside the housing, and if you'll notice there's two sides to it. You got an inner and an outer, so there's your two. And then we have inner and outer thrust washers. And these are separate from the insert. So two and two, we have six. Now the reason why we do that is because by having six surfaces, no matter what happens, the bushing is going to allow movement on that control arm. It's going to go straight up and straight down. It also doesn't deflect fore and aft, or they'll allow the arm to shift a little like rubber would under severe loads. There's a steel pin that goes inside, slides in here like this, as you can see. That all goes together. And this just simply goes together like this. Install it in the frame. Now when you torque the bushing down, you're torquing against the steel pin. So it's 70, 80 pounds torque on these lowers. And by the way, you have a grease fitting that goes in the bushing, as you can see. So you can lube these while they're on the car. Inside the housing, it also has grease grooves, channels for grease to get through the bushing. So again, now you don't have no squeaks. But when this goes in that frame and you torque down, it torques against the steel pin, and so this bushing floats. It goes up and down smoothly with no trouble whatsoever. It removes any bind in the suspension. So the car responds better. These are great for drag racing, road racing, autocross, street. I have them on everything I own. And we, like I said, we've been making these since the 1980s. And they're every, in every tubular arm we do, the Dowlum bushing is prominent through all, all of our systems. They have a limited lifetime warranty. We know that these things will go well over 100,000 miles without any troubles whatsoever. Now you might be looking at, what is this? Well in the kits, we give you a little angle plate here. And that's a press tool to help keep the ears of the lower control arm separated when you press the bushings in. It's just an aid this way. The Dowlum bushing now, for those years, there's two different kits General Motors did. From 82 to mid-84, they, they ran a smaller diameter bushing. These longer ones, as you see here, were the same in, in both arms, but they ran a smaller diameter bushing. And then in mid-84 through 92, they came up with a larger diameter. I don't know if you could see that. That's the only difference. So when you're looking at an 84, and you're thinking about going to our Dello looms, make sure you check your control arm and see what size bushing you have. So for example, this bushing size for 82 through mid 84 is about an inch and five eighths in diameter if you were to measure across here. From mid 84 and a half through 92, this bushing here is gonna be one and 15 sixteenths, almost two inches through here. So there's quite a bit of difference between the two, but a simple check will make sure that you get the right parts the first time. So, 1021 for 82 through 84 and a half, 1022 for 84 and a half through 92. The Dowlum bushing, great for all applications. If you're rebuilding your car, this is something you may want to consider. If you enjoyed this video and are interested in other videos that we may do or other products that we may have, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and check us out on Instagram. Thanks again.